I don't know what them people over doing. <laughs> oh, I need to get out. I'm fixing to go to the house. <laughs> Well, good morning, folks. We're here at Navarra, Florida, and we're going to do some red fishing and possibly speckled trout. We're going to catch what we can. We're going to be fishing artificials. Currently, the surface temperature here is 62 on top. This is 100% salt water. This is not brackish water this time like the previous videos. Uh, the air temperature's, temperature's probably around 60, and it's pretty nice out here. And today, I have with me Ricky Wallace, Wallace uh, Knife Works Fishing and Outdoors. Pardon me, I hadn't had all my coffee yet. We're going to start fishing docks. Let's see what we can do. All right, I'm pulling up here to the first dock right here. Now, if y'all can see, this is a real poor neighborhood down through here. Everybody on this beach, well, they eat beans. Okay, but we're going we're going to start fishing these docks right here, and I'm going to be using bait types like this, which I'll put on the Amazon links. I'm going to be changing to a lot of different baits. Um, this is a Z-Man bait right here, and I have the tail dyed red, folks. I have about a 12-foot leader right here with 12-pound test line tab with a double uni knot it's my connection and I'm using 10 pound braid so I'm taking a chance but uh, I'd rather catch fish like this and be at a disadvantage I don't want to horse a fish in now right here these docks is probably going to average 6 to 8 feet is what it looks like they'll probably vary and uh, we're just going to kind of pitch around these posts let the bait fall straight down. When it makes contact, we'll just move it on the bottom. Now the water temperature, surface temperature is at 62 degrees, so there's no need, I don't think, to work a bait quick. There we go. We got some fish right here in front of this dock. No. Well, he's pulling. They're all good. But let's see what we got. <laughs> it's a trout. Another speckled trout right here. That's a respectable fish. Look at there. Look at there. If I can hold on to him this time, folks, I'll show him to you. A lot of people don't fish salt water or Hatton, but look at that orange mouth. Speckled trout. Or spotted sea trout's the real name for this fish. Ain't that pretty. Woo! And all we're doing right here, I'll show you. Let's let him go. He is working this bait real slow. We're going to make another cast out there. I believe there's some more out in front of this dock. Or hopefully they are. And the water right here is 11 feet deep, a little bit deeper than what we've been fishing. And I'm letting it hit the bottom and just barely moving it. Making it look like a shrimp. Shrimp are real slow. There's another bite right there, but that's croaker. We got a lot of croaker right here. I'm just jumping this thing about every two, three, four inches. Like that and letting it sit a couple seconds. And then that's what happens right there. Another fish. This trout's a little bigger than the last one. A little better. Let's see what we got here, folks. Now, speckled trout, can, that's really a good trout. Let's flip him in the boat here. That's a good one. We'd like to catch us, and that's a long son of a gun right there. He's long and skinny. He he looks like Elmo's cousin, Barabbas. Okay. That's how we do it. Hey! 
good release right there. Uh, speckled trout is one of the hardest fish in the world to hold on to. But what we're going to do is go on up here and catch another. Let's do it. Woo! Woo! Okay. <laughs> Let's catch another. Just barely, barely, barely crawl that jig. And there he is. There's another fish. Okay. Now that trout jumped. That's another good one. It's a good fish right here. And normally the way I do it is I just flip them in here like that. Okay. Trout fish. Is that not a beautiful fish? Folks, look at this tail there. Salt water, something another tries to eat everything else. It's dangerous. Let's let him go right there. Woo! 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 <laughs> Just barely, barely moved that. A shrimp is a slow critter. If you're wanting to imitate a shrimp, they're not even fast when the water's hot, folks. When they flip their tail, they don't move but four or five inches when they are at. <laughs> so let's make it look like a shrimp to them. There we go. There's another one. These fish are staying here, folks. I don't... I'm trying to take advantage of it, too. This is a little... Nah, pretty good trout right here. Just as quick as we're catching them right here. I mean, they don't have to stay here. Let's flip him in the boat. Another good, one. Another good trout. That's why we're fishing hard and fast. Because I want y'all to look. See all that water? They don't have to stay nowhere. They're constantly moving like any other fish. That quit. About like a crappie. I tell you what, folks. I'm going to start using big words like they use around in here. I am so, so super stoked. Y'all, let's let him go. Whoa. There we go. There's another one, folks. This particular dock right here is just full of trout. Now we ain't caught no gator trout, but we've caught some pretty good trout right here. And there he is. I mean, they is a pile of trout out there, but they won't hit it. You gotta just slide it across the bottom like I mentioned before. And at the end, let's let him go. At the end of the video, I'm going to show y'all this bait. This is a tough bait. I've done probably caught, oh, 12 or 15 trout on this one bait right here. Without them tearing it up. It's a Z-Man bait, but I forget the name of it. But I will let y'all know it's a trout killer. Me and Ricky was talking about how darn old we was getting. How old are we getting? Old enough to where we don't much care what we say. <laughs> <laughs> we're so old when we were when we were youngins to go fishing. We had to walk uphill and then go down the hill and back up the hill to the beach. Uh huh. Right, when we came home, we had to go uphill all the way home. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I didn't got it. <laughs> I understand that. You cannot move this bait much. Real slow. Look at there, look at there, look at there. We'd have supper, wouldn't we? Well, if we can't catch a redfish, we'll catch a trout, won't we? Look at there, what a mouthful of teeth in there, folks. Look at there, he nearly got my finger, too. We're gonna have to get the pliers a hold of this one. There he is. Florida speckled trout. Ain't that beautiful fish?
Let's put him back. There he goes. Folks, we got some dolphins out here playing. I'm going to see if I can get close to them. They're either playing or they're schooling or rounding up fish and eating them. Like mullet or white trout or things of that nature. There they are. Can y'all see them? Oh my goodness. Ain't that pretty. <laughs> it just is. Look at him right there. He's looking. They're looking at me, wondering, what are you doing following us for? Now, we're hunting. They ain't let us fish today. They keep running off for fish. Look at there. They, they're... <laughs> they going to put on a show for us. Yeah. I'm live on Facebook. My camera's on. <laughs> oh, man. Such a beautiful, beautiful mammal. Well, folks, that's going to end it right now. Being I'm here in Florida, I'm going to restart another video. We're going to try to target and find some redfish next. Maybe trout, just whatever we can catch. But uh, I tell you, this is called the Z-Man XT Tough Trick Shots is the bait. Let me pull it out right here so y'all can see it. Trout eat it up. One reason is because it's white with silver fleck. And then another thing that I done was dyed the tail with dipping glow, red dye. And that's what got it done. And I'm pretty sure these reds will hit this bait too. Right now the water temperature is so cold, well for salt water it is, you need to work that bait real slow, in my opinion. But Ricky, I've enjoyed it, and we ain't done. We're fixing to venture out and hunt some more fish. What do you think? Yep, I enjoyed it too. We had a good day, a good morning. Beautiful up here in Florida. Yeah, we did. We caught a lot of fish, a lot of small ones, but some decent speckled trout. I want to thank y'all very much for watching. All the great comments, everything that y'all do for this channel. Hey, I hope there ain't nobody watching fancy people but folks <laughs> I got to be who I am I'm not going to do any different than that because I am Richard Jean the Fishing Machine Woo. Hey Whoa And remember Go fishing when you can Because it's good food